What's good, nigga? What's good, YouTube? Davey and I'm wanting to come in. Mr. I'm wanting to come in. Look, it's a lot of traffic right here. Shit cracking right now. But look, I got all dressed and shit because I gotta go get my mom's brake fixed. You know what I'm saying? I was mad at first, then I had to realize, bro, it's life. And plus, she gonna give me my money back. You feel me? Like I said, if you, if you not stressing, you ain't got no responsibilities in life, bro. I ain't about to hold you up. Gotta be out for a little bit. I gotta hit the store too. I gotta get some laundry detergent and shit. So we're gonna be out for a couple of minutes. They don't eat that. What the fuck is that? Get that shit out your mouth, bro. Matter of fact, you gotta come over here. We gotta leave. I'm gonna take you all the way down there. Feel me? So we're gonna do a little bit running around. I'm gonna get, get some recording in when I can. You know, obviously, each place we go, try to get some recording. And I hope they do this break shit fast. I ain't never went with them to go get their breaks done. So I hope hope the breaks and shit get done fast. Come on, use the restaurant. So yeah, I hope this shit go like smooth. Hey man, welcome back to the channel. If y'all been enjoying everything so far, man, make sure I like, yeah, make sure I give it a like, subscribe, and all that shit. I know, man. I'm breaking out right here. These all, here, these all out here, just stress bumps and shit, man. Going stress, man. It's life. Get over the shit. You feel me? But right now, 80% is not subscribed. 20% is subscribed. Make sure y'all subscribe up if y'all enjoyed the videos. More content away, more bangers on the way. Go. On. I got these hoes on. With these type of jeans, and with the Batman hoodie on, and I got my I got my two strand twist out. Wearing that expensive shit, that Burberry, feel me? Touch, probably cheap as fuck. I don't know. Grandma made the rice. These is frozen orange chicken. Grandpa fish. I'm not gonna try all that, but I'm gonna try the fish. In the frozen orange chicken and then the cooked rice. So, frozen orange chicken and rice right here. Boom. I'm going to try it off for y'all again. That's why I love cooking my grandma's house. My grandma I always make sure I eat. She even said I had the leftover burgers. I seen it, but I didn't want to touch it because I didn't know if I could touch it or not. So, I'm going to go ahead and try everything for y'all. Feel me? Hold on. Let me set that up. All right. I'll see you. We're going to start with the frozen orange chicken. This frozen orange chicken. We're going to try the rice now. Mm. Mm-hmm. 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 Fish, fried fish. Fish batter good, still crispy. Cause it's all left over. So for there to still be leftovers, it's really crispy. Obviously, obviously seasoned well. Nice texture to it. Different type of fish. They don't take like the it don't taste like the catfish, you know, the other fishes we used to. For the frozen orange chicken, four or five. They just frozen orange chicken. You can't mess that up. For the rice, with because it's plain because it's plain rice. It wasn't no no special plate of rice. Cool look like six. It just rice. And for the fish. I tried again.
for the quality of the fish because it's a cheaper fish and the batter is crispy that's good i try my grandpa make better fish so this fish is a six two that's the last thing we're gonna try to burger it. it's the last thing We're gonna try it without the we're gonna try it without the pickle first. Burger right here with mushrooms and cheese. Juicy. Can taste the season though. This burger is still good though. Despise all that. Still juicy, still edible. That's all that matters. Let's try with the pickle on top. The pickle add that crunch it was missing. Even better with the pickle on top. This burger is like a good, a good six too. Then we got some homemade brownies. Right here. Not heated up or nothing. Just try it. Nice thick texture. Very, very creamy inside. good eight that's a good eight and that's rating grandma's cooking <laughs> feel me it's all leftovers so good ratings for leftovers feel me can't go wrong with that right here it's leftovers fire it all anytime you need it taking this home to kill this burger that burger was absolutely slamming God! scrape my plate then throw away never throw away grippers food don't care if it's the worst I had or the mid I had, I never throw any food, I eat it all. Brownies and Reese's, take that home. Devour that with some almond milk. Um, I'm gonna finish the one I had bit off of. Now I'm gonna devour all the rest of them later. Feel me? Ain't nothing. Easy work. To me, fire. Look, I know I didn't record the whole process and shit. Basically, like last three hours, I was helping my mom get her shit, her car repaired and shit. Boom, boom, boom. So we had to end up going to the <coughs> auto shop twice, bro twice you feel me because first time we usually get checked out by some young nigga and and he was just basically rushing just trying to get us out of there boom 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 and we ended up getting everything we didn't need so we went back there got my credit and then got the right shit we need to get you feel me so that little process will happen and shit and on top of that you know the mechanic was talking about some personal shit so i didn't want to pull out the camera and his business all on, on on youtube and shit so you know what i'm saying i was just trying to keep it sweet and shit you feel me but look Yeah, y'all see there's tacos right there. About to whip these tacos up. Fam about to eat some fam about to eat some tacos and shit. You know what I'm saying? We just came back from my grandma's house. Cause that's where they, that's where the setting took place. So I got these brownies right here. I brought back with me these Reese's. I'm about to sneak these up to my room because ain't nobody getting none of these. I'll kill these tonight with some almond milk. <laughs> yeah. On that type of timing. But make sure y'all niggas subscribe up, bro. We on the road to a thousand. It's a quick reminder. I'm gonna get to y'all when these tacos is done. I already pretty much did the base seasoning, season a little bit more. 
taco seasoning. Boom, perfecto. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna try tacos. Food done. About to make the play right now. Y'all see how I marinate this shit look, bro. Look like it been it look like it been in a slow cooker for like a day or something. It's very seasoned well. I tried the meat already. But let me try the combination together. I got hummus on the tortillas. Let me know how it tastes, Pop. Mm -hmm. These fire. Season well, right amount of tomatoes in each bite, perfect amount of seasoning. I said that season well. Yeah, everything just goes juicy. It's not dry, how I usually make it. Yeah, this is fire. And it got a little spice to it, a little kick to it, a little spice kick to it. Fire. The power of cooking with love does mysterious things. Try my hardest when I cook anything, even if I don't feel like cooking. Try to come out at least some some type of good. This right here, I did something with this. That's where I got it from, from grandparents. Make it with love. Yes, sir. That's the end of this video, man. Let y'all niggas God on my cook, man. I hope y'all enjoy, man. <laughs> I'll go, bro. Oh.